I did not think they were going to do it, but they did it. PlayStation put out their state of play. I didn't think they were going to actually feature this game specifically, but they proved me wrong. Stellar Blade gameplay overview trailer. And this is about like six minutes. So I've been waiting for this game for so long and it's probably has a long way before it actually comes out. But I am like totally anticipating this. So this is going to be juicy. I'm ready. She has so many outfits. A whole new IP, new engine. Shift up. Welcome to the world of Stellar Blade. The Wait, story begins huh? on post apocalyptic Earth. Okay. Where a mysterious enemy called the Nativa has forced the human race to flee to an off world colony. Nativa. Players will take control of Eve, a member of the 7th Airborne Squad. Oh, they kept it. Her mission is to save the planet by defeating the Elder Nativa. Okay. All we must do is complete the mission. While most of the 7th Airborne Squad is lost during their descent from the colony, Eve soon meets two new companions. Okay. Anne, born on Earth, like is in pursuit of an energy source step. called Hypersight. Make sure to stay cautious. It's where the Alpha and AT by is. So this must be eight or seven. Look her accent. Lily, a member of the fifth airborne squad, provides engineering support. Lily Artemis the second. <laughs> they all have one. <laughs> she puts her technical knowledge to use by upgrading Eve's equipment throughout the game. That's great. Here. Done. Something does feel different. She'll be our level up junkie. Double jump. This is Zion, a city built underneath the wasteland by the last human survivors on Earth. A whole city underneath the wasteland. <laughs> Eve is called Angel. Angel by the survivors and is an object of both awe Zion. and fear. I'm not selling Angel. anything to you. They'll seem a bit wary at first, what but will gradually heck? loosen up as Eve shows a commitment to rebuilding yes. the city. Hello, Angel. How are you? I see we have guests. Oh, we saw him oh, before. The angel is here. Look at her. The survivors will sometimes ask Eve for help. Please save my younger sister. Right here. <laughs> A classic side quest characters. Their requests will often lead her to the wasteland and the great desert. So many like there's lo so many locations. This place has been overrun by Nativas. And malfunctioning machines and robots. Yeah, she has like several different outfits. Like Sick. It. In a place like this, you'll occasionally find supply stations set up by previous airborne squads. Hmm. At each camp, Eve can purchase various consumable <laughs> items. Oh man, this Acquire is so good. Skills. Upgrade equipment and more. Attack power enhancement. She can also take a well-deserved break to restore her health. It's kind of like a rise of the Tomb Raider a little bit. Eve will often encounter people in need and other non-human beings who may need her help. Request your assistance. Whether hmm. to assist or ignore them is entirely up to the player. Oh, really? On her journey to defeat the Elder Nativa. Eve will sometimes encounter hostile survivors. Choose your own adventure. Uh-oh. Or... Give hand line. <laughs> Eve. Literally. What are you going to do after you defeat the Alpha Nativa? All airborne squad members exist for one sole purpose. You mean... Extinction of all Nativas, right? To think that the point of your existence is to snuff out another species. It is not an easy fight. It doesn't seem likely, I'll be honest. It won't be easy. Angel, that's the unofficial name for members of the Eve Airborne Squad. You can't just wipe out a whole 
I can feel the hatred, but I cannot feel the source. I will find it, and I will make it pay. Open it! It's windy! It's just gonna keep growing. I can't believe this is the actual engine, bro. Oh. The drone is different. This is no longer the drone you knew. So My God. This better be in the game too, the soundtrack. Stalker. This looks so sick. Yes. I knew this one, man. I saw it. Oh. Okay, now here's the problem. This should come to PC one of these days, but it's probably going to be like a year or so. But wow, that is soon. It seemed like they it was so far off before, and now it's April 26th. Are you kidding me? I might have to mess around and get a PlayStation, man. I might just have to. But I would love to play it on PC, though. Like, still. Ugh. Either way, though, man. This is exactly what I'm talking about when it comes to, like, a game to really get me intrigued. Because there's nothing like a game where, you know, you have your main character, especially as someone of this stature, <laughs> if you know what I mean. And they have all these different outfits and... They, you know, keep things fresh. Uh, you know, obviously third person combat, skill trees, being able to level up. And I don't know if it's necessarily going to be an entirely single player experience, but I hope it is. Because sometimes I miss that. I, I honestly miss that. I've been playing all these like live service games of recent and, you know, I don't mind them. But like it, it, I miss that that experience of just playing a single player game from start to finish. You know, and just unlocking all the unlock unlockables and like new game plus and stuff like that. I miss that, you know, so definitely looking forward to this and then picking this up no matter what. I Yeah, I don't know, man. I would like to get it on PC, but I'm probably going to be sitting there waiting for like a year, you know, because they do come to PC event. They come to Steam eventually, but I think this is going to be exclusive for PlayStation 5. But either way, yeah, this looks fantastic. Let me know what you guys think about it in the comments below. Um, do you think you're going to be getting this as well? I, this is like, I've been looking forward to this since like the last two years. Like before it was called Project Eve. That's when I was checking this out. So, man, it, yeah, it looks phenomenal. It looks phenomenal. And this is like a new, this is like a new dev I've never heard of. Shift up. At least I don't think I've heard it before. So, yeah, I can't wait for it. And for sure this might actually make me like this might be a console grabber this might make me actually get the console i've had nothing like, against playstation i just you know my family has always been on xbox so i've always just had that sitting around but yeah looking forward to it definitely want to pick this up for sure and i guess we'll see you on april 26th i'll catch you guys in the next one